Hey guys, welcome back to the channel, and today in this video, I'm gonna show, how to install macOS Sonoma on Intel Nukes. So before starting, if you haven't subscribed to our channel, then please go and subscribe to our channel and stay connected for the latest updates. So without a further ado, let's get started. For this purpose, you'll require Open Core Package, Open Core Configurator, and EFI according to your target hardware. To create an EFI for yourself, follow the guide from the I button. Also, one USB with a minimum of 1 GB is required. Firstly, we'll create a macOS Sonoma bootable USB and after that, we will install it. For creating the USB, you'll need Python. And I'm assuming that Python is already installed. And now, I'll just follow the previous guide for creating the bootable USB. You can find the link below or check out the video from I button. When copying the EFI, also copy Open Core Configurator and paste it to USB. And now the USB is ready and it can be used for installation. Now, power on your nuke and boot to BIOS. Here, load BIOS defaults and then change the following settings. After making the changes, exit BIOS saving changes, and now, plug the bootable USB, and boot to boot menu. From here, select your USB, followed by the UEFI prefix, 
and press enter to boot. After booting to open core, make sure to reset NVRAM ones, and again, boot via USB. After booting again, boot using EFI DMG and wait for some time to boot to the installer. From here, select your preferred language and click on the right arrow button. And now before proceeding, make sure that you're connected to the internet, for connecting to the internet, you can use a USB router USB to Ethernet adapter, Ethernet, or Wi-Fi if available. After getting connected, select Disk Utility and click on Continue. Here, click on View and then click on Show All Devices. Now select your main drive instead of any partitions and click on the Erase button and erase the drive with the following parameters. After erasing the drive, close the disk utility, and now select Reinstall macOS Sonoma, and click on Continue. And here, if clicking on Continue doesn't work, quit, install macOS and continue with it again, and proceed with the installer. Here, select the drive you created, and then click on Continue. Keep in mind that the installation process may take a while depending on your internet speed and during the installation, your laptop will restart several times. So don't worry about it.
Finally, the macOS Sonoma setup screen is here. Set up your macOS according to your preferences. Hi, I'm Siri. Choose the voice you'd like me to use. You can change it later in system settings. After reaching the Sonoma desktop, you must make your Nuke boot independently, without USB. For that, open Open Core Configurator and mount the EFI partition of the system drive. After mounting the EFI partition, copy the EFI folder from your USB, and paste it into the EFI partition of the system drive. After putting the EFI, eject the EFI partition and USB as well, and now restart your nuke, and boot to macOS Sonoma without using USB. Finally, everything is done, and as you can see, macOS Sonoma is running on Intel Nuke. So that was it, hope it was useful. Consider like for the video, and subscribe to the channel. And if you have any questions, just comment down below, or create a thread on our forum. Make sure to check out the forum for in-depth guides. Thanks for watching and have a great day ahead.